Hi there, I'm Cameron. And I'm David, and we're Jeffco parents. Did you know many middle schools in Jeffco will soon be serving three grades instead of two? Starting with the 2018-19 school year, many of our Jeffco elementary schools will be transitioning sixth graders to middle school. Whoa, kind of scary, right? Ah! Actually, no, it's not. Several areas in Jeffco have already made the move and it's working well. And, across the country, 75% of 6th graders are already in middle schools. This move offers our 6th grade students more educational choice. A chance to try new things and take advantage of having more resources to learn at different levels. Why do this now, you ask? The why is easy. First, because it's best for kids. Second, it's better use of our school buildings. Most of our middle schools were originally built for three grades. Over 100 tent buildings at elementary schools will no longer be needed after this move. The why now answer is why wait? Change is never easy. Doing this now or a year from now presents the same challenges. We have the resources and time to make the move now, so let's get this done for our kids. Have questions? Yep, we're sure you do. Some we have anticipated, and some probably not. However, here's the answer to the number one question. Yes, sixth graders will still go to Outdoor Lab. The second question is probably, when will my school transition sixth graders? At the end of this video, there's a list of schools with that information. It's also available through your current school or on the district website. There are a lot of resources to get answers to the rest of your questions. Jeffco Public Schools website. Middle and elementary school websites. Emails from the principals and district. Open houses at the middle schools. And student visits to the middle schools. So what do you need to do? Basically the same thing you would be doing if going from 6th to 7th grade just a year earlier. In October and November, check out your home middle school. See what it's all about. You may also want to look around at other school options. If you want to attend a school other than your assigned home school next year, turn in the choice enrollment form to that school during choice enrollment January 8th through the 31st. You'll typically hear in February if there's room for your student. In February and March, future middle school students will work with the middle school counselors to sign up for classes, including electives. In April and May, students usually take a field trip to visit their new middle school. And finally, students go to their new school next fall. We know this is new and can make some parents nervous. But ultimately, the benefits outweigh the concerns. So be sure to read the information on the 6th grade transition webpage, go to the meetings, and ask questions. And enjoy this new adventure. Here is a general list by elementary school, though there are some exceptions. For details, go to the designated school locator tool and enter your home address, or see the 6th grade transition page on jeffcopublicschools.org. If your elementary school is not on the list, 6th grade at your elementary school has a different transition date or a different school model.